Hi there, welcome back to MTurk Guide. Today I'd like to go over earnings updates for two weeks because I've been a little lackadaisical about giving my earnings update and my usual bonus of the requesters that I worked on during this time frame, as well as um, what I've been working on recently. So I kind of expanded the time date range a little bit to uh, give a little bit more information about what's happening now since you know, some of this information is a little old. Diving right in. Weekly earnings for the week ending December 4th, um, I had 1,970 submitted and 1,871 approved. And this was kind of uh, the reset after Thanksgiving. I didn't work as much around that time period. And I think a lot of hits that I had been sitting for a while hit their AA. And so I was kind of like at a clean slate when I came out. I didn't really have much pending earnings. So I was really looking to turn over some hits that I knew would approve and, um, you know, accumulate some money for the week, especially given that, you know, we're approaching the holidays. So that was kind of my goal and which is why, you know, you see my submitted and my approved pretty much almost aligned you know, to about a hundred in between them. Uh, during that time, I had no rejected hits, makes me happy. Uh, the bonus reward earned was small, $1.40, uh, probably some receipt bonuses for <laughs> 411 Richmond. And the hit reward earns 180.81 for a grand total of 182.21. As you know, my weekly goal is 140, so I surpassed that goal, so it makes me happy. And my I push all those earnings into December just because the majority of the week was December. So my month to date is the same at 182.21, and it brings my year to date to $7,640.77. As I've said numerous times, you know, I don't make a ton of money, um, but I have specific goals for the money that I do make. So it's if I needed to make more, I, I think I could putting in more hours. But this is, you know, kind of what I need um, to keep the kids and, you know, extra toys and little day trips and long term vacations. So I know everybody has their own goals out there. I'd love to hear what you guys are turking for. Um, but yeah, and if you set goals, I'm interested in that as well, if you if you set goals like I do. Okay, enough about that. Um, moving on to the week ending December 11th, which was this past week, and it was a great week for me, um, with the number of hits submitted being higher to reflect that at 3,726, uh, 3,883 approved, no rejects. Bonus reward was high at $31.15, and $25 of that was based on um, a, a bonus for three surveys that were completed around the election and the election results. Uh, it was a, like October, November, December, one each month. And then if you did all three in the specified time period, you got a $25 bonus, which was great. Uh, and the surveys themselves were very fairly paid. So overall, I was very happy with that survey. And that requester, her name, Heather Lynch. Um, and so uh, the hit reward, reward earned was 258.82 for a grand total, 289.97, which for my month, my, sorry, my weekly goal of 140, I mean, that's like 140, under almost $150 over. So I was thrilled with that, especially giving as we approach the holidays. Things are just going to get busier and I'm not 100% sure that I will be able to um, hit, you know, weekly goals, although my overall goal monthly will be there. I just don't think I'm going to be able to hit the weekly goals. And that's OK for me, as long as I hit my monthly goal, I don't really care how I get there. I mean, it's great if I can do it in two weeks or two and a half weeks and then call it a month. That's great. Um, but so where that brings me. For my December is 472.18, which actually isn't that far off. I think this we're into, you know, far into the following week now. And I'm actually, I think I'm beyond my monthly at this point. I think I'm at um, 140 for this week. I just hit my weekly goal yesterday. So um, I'm going to be over my monthly goal in the next earning report, which is great because it means I can focus on some other things for a while. Um, and that brings my year to date to $7,930.14. So I will be over the $8,000 mark uh, at the next earnings update. So to get to the nitty gritties, the top requesters for the time period. And I said this is about two and a half weeks. It was uh, the two weeks of earnings that we discussed and then a few days uh, on each end just to give a sense of what was going on at the time and 
what's going on now. So the big one for me, and you continue to see it, is OCMP5. I, just in case anybody's new to my earnings updates, OCMP5 posted their qual back in November. You had to have 5,000 approved hits and a specific um, percentage approved to even do the qualification test. And then if you got the qual, you can do these hits. There are uh, it's categorization. They're five cents each. They post them every day, every other day in pretty big batches. Um, so I've honestly just been hamming those because they're quick. I'm, I'm a avid online shopper. So um, it, I, a lot of the stuff that's there I'm familiar with and I can categorize it pretty easily. So um, you can see that's a heavy hitter for me, you know, actually, you know, $218 and three cents. Um, so, which is obviously it's sorry, they're five cents and four cents hits, which is why it's three cents. Um, so mostly I do the five cents, but if there's nothing up, I do the four cents as well. So um, that'll probably be my heavy hitter for a while, as long as they're posting, because I just, I like their hits and I can do them and, you know, have a TV on in the background or whatever. My next one is our Lord Zoltar. He has graced us with his presence. He is back. Um, the story with Zoltar, there was a couple of days this week where, well, first of all, he was trickling, they were trickling in, you know, trickle, trickle, trickle. Some people got, you know, 40, some people got seven. I wasn't getting many. And then like for two days, they posted from eight, 10 to like noon. And it was the 20 cent ones, the 12 cent ones, the six cent ones, and then new plumbing six cent ones, which I need to do a video on if they keep coming. Um, and those were, you know, everybody was capping on them. It was fabulous. Um, but as of this morning, which is Thursday, December 15th, I believe, um, they're kind of back to that 805, 807 posting and stopping around 945 and they're just 12 cent ones for the most part. Um, so, you know, that a lot of people can cap on that depending on their internet speed and things in the speed of how fast they do the hits. I know other people are still spooling up on how to do them, but if you're in the U S and you can, you know, you can be at your computer at eight Oh seven Eastern time, you know, they're, they're pretty good. Um, and as you can see, they comprised a, a pretty good amount of, of my, uh, earnings. The next one is our, another fan favorite picks from above and they're back. I've uh, been doing them here and there. They've been posting um, most every day, but as of today, again, December 15th, they've, they've, I don't think they've been posting as much, but hopefully they'll have more for us to do. Um, you know, the, they do require that you get the qual, but the qual is auto granted. So you just got to go into the qualifications. Usually I post the qual number on the Facebook page, go into the qualification, type in picks from above, um, then find the qual number, request it, and then kind of refresh a couple times. And you should be able to go ahead and pick up some of those hits. Um, the downside is they definitely slow down at times, especially when people are doing them in prime time. You know, I suspect just a lot of people are doing them. And so they start to slow down. Um, all I can say is, you know, multitask while the screen is changing, if it's changing super slow or open, you know, multiple windows and have a different hit in every window so that hopefully, you know, if all the planets align every time you switch to a window, you have something to work on. Um, so just some thoughts of, of how you might want to handle that when the slowdown happens. Uh, but it does, and it's unfortunate because they're, they're pretty good hits otherwise. Another one that popped up this week, or yeah, last week, whatever, it was cognitive development. Um, the, I call affectionately call these baby heads. Uh, it's kind of become a funny term. Everybody says, oh, baby heads are dropping. And it's like, what? Uh, but what they are is it's a some sort of research study where they, they strap some sort of camera to, to babies' heads. I mean, I have to imagine the cameras are pretty light because you know, babies' heads, but um, aren't that strong sometimes. So they strap a camera to the baby's heads and then this camera must take periodic pictures. Um, and I think they're just trying to get a, what the baby's perspective is. And these are babies in their own homes. So what you have to do is you have to type for 20 pictures, five things that are in the pictures. And that's not including like body parts and stuff. So, you know, like um, there's a couch, there's a window, there's a chandelier, there's a picture frame, there's a spoon. You know, there's a table, there's a chair, there's a, you know, a shirt, jeans, things like that. Um, refrigerator, you know, I could go on and on. Um, but 
what they're a dollar a piece and if you know if you're a fast typer you can you can pretty much fly through them um i do believe though that the minimum number of approved hits you need to have to do them are ten thousand. so i know that some people who who listen are still building up their numbers but for those that are close to the ten thousand mark or over the ten thousand mark um you might want to look into these you know, they can get a bit tiring um, and they did up the timer on them. So you have a little bit more time to do them. Uh, but, you know, it's a little bit different. It's certainly not the usual Zoltar or whatever. Um, and you get to see like inside people's houses and stuff. So it's kind of neat. I don't know. I see how people decorate and things like that. Um, so it's, it's definitely a, a, an interesting one. Um, so I did about 18 of those, 18 bucks in my pocket. So it was cool. Um, some of the other ones that are highlights, Stanford Memory Lab. This one was an interesting one. It was actually, you had to like start to memorize and identify different birds, um, like the type of bird. Was it a, you know, was it a, a tree sparrow or was that a, you know, a yellow strap black jacket or whatever? <laughs> so it was, it was like an hour long and, you know, there were a lot of birds, but I, you know, I got through it. I did pretty well. So that was worth 750. Um, they had their lunch. That was the last uh, survey of the three surveys. That was $5. Spitch AG is um, a categorization. Um, they come in like they're 18 cents each, I think. And they give you like a blurb from a forum and you just have to answer questions about the blurb, whether certain things were mentioned or not. They're pretty easy. Uh, they seem to be coming in in batches here and there. Another blast from the, the recent past that came in was Will. Um, I have a video on Will. It's basically gives you 20 clips of videos and he asks you if you can see a human doing a task. So, you know, is a human clapping? Is a human laughing? Is a human you know, playing golf? Things like that. And if it's, you know, a video or, uh, of like uh, people playing, if it's like those screencasts of gamers or whatever and there's no actually humans in it then you you know that's a that's a, a no-go you error that one um and then it's yes or no so those ones came up those are um those are endor so you 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 want to be careful about returning those although there have been some reports of people returning it and still being able to access them um i would Again, they extended the timer to 10 hours. So if the lockout does occur and say like will posts overnight and you grab them and they, they expire on you and then you wake up and try to do Zoltar, there is a chance that you'll be locked out of Zoltar depending on how the timer goes. If the timer, the 10 hours, you know, goes past the 8 a.m. mark. So just be careful about the will and the Zoltar situation if they continue to drop. And then sometimes in the morning, will and Zoltar will drop at the same time. And that can get a little hairy of having both in your queue. So my advice is to pick one or the other um, just because it having both, you can get that um, error message, the reload error message. So, you know, I'd be careful about that is, is all I'm going to say about that. So... And then the other ones that are on this list are basically surveys. So um, nothing overly interesting about those, just surveys that were decent paying for the time required. Um, so that's kind of the highlight of, of the top requesters. And as far as this week goes, I've been working on OCMP5 a lot. Um, and there have been a few other batches that have come in and some surveys I've tried to post some of the goings on on the Facebook page. Um, every day I try to pin a post to the top and everybody is welcome to post hits in there that they're working on and they think are interesting and certainly feel free to ask any questions in there. As usual, please feel free to ask questions in the comments here on YouTube. Please subscribe so you don't miss anything. And please ask me any questions that you may have. I have a list of videos I really want to get to for everybody, but if there are specific questions, I really want to address those first. So I know people are looking for info on Panda Crazy. I'll be posting a video about that soon. Um, and then there is another uh, new tool that's uh, geared towards the new interface. And I've been playing around with that. I'm definitely going to post a video on that soon just to I got to make sure I understand it first. So I don't want to give out any erroneous information. So as usual, I appreciate you listening. Please like, subscribe, share, and let me know how your turking is going. Thanks, everybody. Happy turking.